again while we're stuck with maintenance duty in Mars of all places? As if anyone's gonna attack our backyard. Seriously, we're already three months out of cadet school and they still fob us off with housekeeping jobs. We should be out there, with intervention, saving the universe. We have a civilian ship signaling distress from the outskirts of the sector. Apparently they're having some sort of emergency. Uh, engine failure. Permission to investigate. Mars doesn't do accidents, cadet. Permission granted. Proceed with caution. Oh, Xenon! Breaking formation! Seriously, what the? Since when does Xenon send out fake distress signals? Nelly, analysis. Classification, high-tech trader, crew, deceased, cargo, classified, reconstructing events. Permission has been denied. Investigation terminated. That's quite enough. Our specialists will take over from here. And you, cadets, will hear from me shortly. Dismissed. Someone or something raided that trading vessel for highly classified high-tech goods. They knew the trade route in the outer reaches of our stronghold sector and took out nearby satellites to let the distress signal run aground. And on top of that, Xenon scouts are still drawn to the wreckage days after the incident. Militia, squadrons, and foreign auxiliaries. Those of you who were not lucky enough to be born on Terran soil, let me hereby welcome you formally into the ranks of the first and last defenders of the Gate Network. And to those who are Sol-born, or even Earth-born, to resist the temptation of heroism and put the defense of our sanctuary first, is a sign of providence and true courage. By coming here, you have already made Earth proud. All squadrons, prepare to launch. We have an incoming Xenon strike force. This is outrageous! The Republic will not stand for this! This sector is vital to the defense of Saul and the entire Gate Network. Nonsense! This is a military occupation of neutral grounds! Damage my ship! Hurt my crew! And everyone will see you as the oppressors you really are! Let me be absolutely clear. The network depends on people like us who won't hesitate to do what's necessary. Okay, everyone, listen up. We've got reports of increased Xenon activity in Savage Spur 2. As everyone is aware, this is the primary Xenon entry point into the region, and it's our duty to handle this situation. Our mission is to initiate a precision strike in order to divert their attention from our movements in Getsufun. All squads, return to base immediately. The entire sector is descending on us. This eternal meat grinder of clashing fleets cannot be a permanent solution. To truly beat the Xenon in a war of attrition, it is paramount that we instead thwart their infrastructure wherever possible. It is beyond dispute that what you have witnessed is of the utmost concern to the Protectorate. We came close to a debacle but I was ultimately able to smooth things over with the Secretary of the Antigone Republic. When interacting with the rest of the Gate Network, we will always attempt to show ourselves from our best angle. But make no mistake, Earth will not allow herself to be abused or threatened ever again. I would like to talk to you about this so-called Project Genesis. That's the codename of a top-secret operation that the Sigaris pioneers are cooking up. Gather whatever information you can, but use your discretion. Remember, this is critical work. Those satellites don't just help with our research, they also serve as a sensor net. What is this? Some large artificial structure. So this is what was on the other side of the tent. You'll be helping one of our associates in acquiring research that is vital to Project Genesis. 
report to Kuramankami. They are experimenting with a phenomenon in the void and will instruct you on your part once you get there. What is it exactly that they're trying to achieve? They are hoping to colonize a planet as a new home for their people. The Terrans once meddled with such terraforming technology, which resulted in the creation of the Xenon. We can no longer ignore the possibility of a major new threat to the Terran Protectorate. Based on recent evidence, my people are fairly sure that our opponents are the infamous Yaki. Our data suggested that they originated as members of the Argon Federation, another splinter group they couldn't keep under control. The Yaki have always dabbled in dangerous technology, and they seem to have only doubled down on that alarming compulsion since we last had the pleasure of making contact. One of their criminal spin-off enterprises, the infamous Beryl, was responsible for an AGI drone attack on Earth in recent history. Expect their ships to be heavily armed and highly maneuverable.